Hey everyone, long time no see. <laughs> I think the last real YouTube video that I posted was two years ago. Anyways, I'm back. <laughs> and today I thought I'm gonna show you my updated everyday makeup. So let's get into it. Okay, I'm usually starting off with a face mist. It just feels very refreshing and it kind of wakes up my skin, I feel like. And it also adds extra hydration. And I'm starting with my favorite primer from Dior Beauty. I just use my fingers and this primer is just the perfect base for a glowy makeup I have pretty dry skin so having a good primer really helps This is my current favorite, it's the Hourglass Tinted Moisturizer This is a few shades darker than my skin tone because as you can tell my body is pretty tan compared to my face It doesn't feel too heavy on your skin and it's also hydrating Using the Hourglass brush and on areas where I need it, I put a bit of concealer. This is by Dior, the Backstage Concealer. It's my absolute favorite. I'm using a small concealer brush. Okay, I don't know why, but on camera, there is still a pretty big difference between my face and the rest of the body, but we're gonna apply bronzer anyways. Moving on to eyebrows, I'm using this micro sculpting pencil. What I love about this is how precise you can work with it. Like very fine and you can build this up like not too much product coming off at once and it just looks very natural you know let me just quickly brush through them okay next I'm doing eyeshadow and I'm using this eyeshadow palette by Colourpop for eyeshadow I always just pick random brown shades and mix them together and just put them on my eyelid okay this should do now moving on to one of my favorite steps, which is nose contouring. I'm using like a neutral brown color. This is from Smashbox. And I just like contour my nose with it. It's like one of the steps that I never skip no matter how much makeup I put onto my face. Like if it's just a minimal makeup, I still do my nose contouring. I just cannot go without it. Okay, next bronzer so that we can finally match the face to the rest of my body. I'm using this one by Kaya Cosmetics. It's like a liquid bronzer. I'm just using a fluffy brush. I really love the color of it because it's so warm. It just really matches the rest of my body. And it's quite easy to work with, so you can easily build this up. This just gives you a very natural tan. I think this should do, right? Moving on to blush. I'm using this Play Blush by MAG. And this is really interesting, like let me show you. If you press on it, it's like a very interesting texture feels very soft, like Play-Doh. Anyways, I'm using a brush to apply this. I'm doing it onto the apples on my cheeks and also on the nose. For eyeliner, I'm using a liquid liner by Kaya Cosmetics and I'm just doing my regular wing. I need to be focused for this. I think it turned out okay. Next for mascara, this is one of my favorites. So first of all, I like to curl them. I have pretty short and straight Asian lashes, so there are not a lot of mascaras that work for me. And this is one of the mascaras that I really like. It's by Clio. Let me just show you the difference. And this is just one coat. I also like to do the bottom lashes. Okay, sorry, my camera just died, but now we're back. You guys can see the difference, right? Yeah. What I also like to do is just take a black pencil liner and tight line my upper waterline. This just makes the lashes look a lot more fuller. I'm gonna quickly do the other eye. Okay, eyes are done. I also like to use some highlighter. I have this one by Florasis. This used to be like a super pretty rose petal, but um, you can't really see it that much anymore. This highlighter is so pigmented, you have to be careful not to put on too much. Okay, so I'm just gonna... You see, it was just one stroke and it's like already... Let me just blend this out a bit. This is like super intense. So you have to be careful with this. And also some of my nose and Cupid's bow. Now moving on to lips. I like to recover them with the rest of my beauty blender first. My lip combo always changes a bit. But right now what I really like to do is uh, this lip pencil by NYX. It's in Nude Truffle. And I like to overline my lips. Then I'm using this MAC Locked Kiss Ink. This is just a matte liquid lipstick. And I fill this into the center of it and I just blend it up. 
And this color is so, so gorgeous. I love it. So we can either leave it as it is, but right now I love gloss. So I'm gonna top it off with a clear gloss. That you can use any clear gloss that you have. And I just like to top it off. Somehow, every time I finish my makeup, I reapply my blush because I feel like it's fading. Like it's going somewhere else. It's leaving my face. So I always have to reapply it. And then for the last step, some fixing spray. I'm using this one by MAC. And then sometimes when I feel like it, I like to powder my face, but not always. Depends on my mood. Sometimes I feel more glowy and sometimes I feel more matte. So I'm using this pressed powder by Florasis again, and I just use it under my eyes and like next to my nose and then a little bit on my forehead and that's basically it this is my everyday makeup it was really fun to sit down and talk to you guys and film another youtube video so yeah i had a lot of fun i hope you guys enjoyed this video too and i'll see you in my next video